While playing a video game, have you ever encountered that annoying monster or goblin that does random actions and keeps doing the same love over and over again? Like, <laughs> we still encounter that because we lack of a proper framework for AI design and we also lack of ways to teach AI to creative people. Through my thesis, I want to give game designers the tools and the vocabulary to design and develop behaviors more easily. Lately, advanced AI models allows us to generate 3D models, to generate voices or adaptive animations and even faces, uh, create music in the style of Bach or Beethoven. However, the ways to implement those behaviors in a video game are not yet self-evident. And the emergence of consumer game engines enabled people around the world to code and create stunning real-time video games. Nonetheless, in AI, it still feels like we keep reinventing the wheel, thus the need of a unified AI framework. My thesis explores design affordances of both new and old AI technologies, asking why are some popular, why are others widely overlooked. Through speculative game design ideas, I explore how they could impact the way that we are making games now and the type of games that we could be making in the future. I aim at creating a dictionary of what a good AI framework for games should include. And to inform my designer, I interview game professionals, asking them what are the roadblocks of AI development in games. But I also practice myself video game AI development with a special focus on affective computing. With this in mind, I created a cute character called Trevor, a cartoon blob who chooses its own behavior based on how he thinks you feel. And Trevor can sense electrical signals on the periphery of your face and interpret your emotions on this basis. Creating such an AI using signal analysis and advanced neural networks allowed me to practically understand what is too complex nowadays and theorize a game designer user experience that would simplify the process of AI creation. With each process we simplify, we widen the chance of innovation to arise in game design. That's why the next step after this thesis will be the creation of a structure dedicated to the realization of this AI framework, a place for AI research and game design. And maybe finally, goblins will actually loaf at your playstyle and your ridiculous armor choice instead of doing it randomly or on repeat. Music